Ahead of Christmas Day, the Salvation Army, alongside many volunteers, helped some of our most vulnerable residents get a little more into the holiday spirit. This morning, they passed out food, clothing, and other necessities, all to bring homeless residents a bit of holiday cheer. New Six's Jerry Askin was there for the giveaway. How thankful are you to receive some help this Christmas? Um, very much so. I haven't done Christmas in like two or three years. It was a Christmas miracle for Summer White and more than a dozen Orlando families, many who live in this wooded area for now. White told me seeing Santa Claus and volunteers bring some holiday cheer made her smile. It makes it a lot easier. She got a hot meal and also received water, clothing and so much more. I just imagine being out on the street and having absolutely nothing. And especially for Christmas. Especially for Christmas, right? Gray Morris said he wanted to give back and try to bring some joy to others. It makes me understand and realize how grateful I am for the things I have and the family I have. It was all thanks to many volunteers who work in part with the Salvation Army. Tom Morris, who is also a board member, helped organize the effort. We're bringing them all new shoes, all new socks, all new underwear, all new hygiene kits. He said he wanted to help after he spotted them living in this wooded area when he left the Joy Center for the Angel Tree program back on December 14th, hosted in partnership with New Six and the Salvation Army. And this is what I like doing. And there's plenty of people that need help, so why not do it? For Sunday's giveaway, the Salvation Army's area commander, Captain Ken Chapman, recognized and prayed for Morris and these many volunteers for getting results and giving back. You guys give them, they're going to give them the biggest exit they've ever had before because these are community heroes. I'm Jerry Askin, getting results, News 6.